Welcome back to the channel. Well, we're back in New Babbage and uh, we've just spawned. And today I just want to uh, actually uh, do a fairly short video on some of the little things which you may not notice uh, in New Babbage because, um, let's face it, whenever you see a lot of players, they seem to be uh, running around like uh, Usain Bolt making for the spaceport which we can see in the distance over there now I want to take a moment just to uh, take in our surroundings and uh, how much work it actually took to create uh, these environments and perhaps we should uh, pay close attention more to the environments than what we uh, usually do. Now as we look over the city of New Babbage we can see um, the uh, train capsule lines uh, arching away in the distance I guess at some point we may be able to explore some more of this city but uh, that's probably for the future but uh, here's a couple of interesting uh, little things I want to share with you first of all clothing now you may not be that um, interested in the clothing of Star Citizen, what they use to uh, clothe the NPCs, but uh, some of the actual design of the clothing for the NPCs in New Babbage actually does deserve a second look, and uh, especially uh, some of the clothing, because uh, I must admit, uh, what this lady's wearing here would sell like hotcakes if they were to find some way of uh, putting it on the uh, RSI store. Let's get a closer look at uh, this lady's uh, very interesting uh, item of clothing, especially her top. Now I'm really intrigued how the artists have uh, actually uh, develop this item of clothing the actual lengths they've gone to to uh, actually uh, get the look of uh, a ship moving in space on a uh, on this lady's uh, top certainly uh, amazing really now there are quite a lot of um, very interesting uh, clothing designs for the NPCs but uh, as far as I'm concerned uh, this one uh, stands out on its own absolutely amazing now the environments outside and inside New Babbage are undoubtedly uh, some of uh, CIG's best work and another thing to look out for when you're maybe running through are the holographic displays now these are really worth taking a closer look at and uh, as we can see here we can actually see holographic fish and uh, it's as if they were uh, actually swimming in a tank in the floor. Also, we can see holographic butterflies. Now, who doesn't like a butterfly? And uh, the plants look pretty realistic. You could be uh, in an episode of uh, Gardener's World. That's a show we have here in uh, the UK, all about uh, planting uh, plants in a garden. So worth looking at these holographic uh, displays, holographic plants and the butterflies as you run through. Very, uh, very interesting and pretty awesome to be honest. Now finally in this um, little bit of a, a different video, of what to look out for in New Babbage is playing with balls. Yes, no, the title isn't clickbait. You can actually 
play with balls in New Babbage. And uh, here we are in the uh, commons, uh, near the exercise uh, part of the uh, dome. Now you can't actually uh, use any of the exercise equipment, but you can play with balls, literally. Now, some time ago, um, there was a thing in Star Citizen where you could move Big Benny's machines uh, throughout the Stanton system. And uh, there used to be a thing where people tried to get them as far as possible. Now, maybe balls could be the next thing. Now, I've not managed to actually get these balls that far as of yet. I think there might be a trouble getting them upstairs. But uh, certainly, it uh, will occupy you, you for a while trying to actually uh, master the ball physics and uh, maybe, just maybe, uh, get them on uh, to the uh, capsule trains and get them heading towards the uh, spaceport. Balls in space? Maybe not. But, uh, well, maybe give it a try yourself and let me know how you do. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little bit of an offbeat video of uh, what to uh, look out for. Maybe what you may miss as you run through the domes in New Babbage. Bye for now. Well, thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you want to sign up for Star Citizen and want to earn 5,000 UEC credits, please use my referral code, which you can see on the screen now. Thank you very much.